Here I am on Mattapeak Beach on the beautiful Chesapeake Bay and I've come to find myself a mermaid. Now, Bruce told me I'd never find a mermaid in the Chesapeake Bay. It's true, I said that. But, check it out. We need to meet each other properly. So what's your name? Hi, I'm Mermaid Tasha. I'm from the Atlantic near Ocean City, but I swim up the Chesapeake all the time to meet my friends and my family and my other Mer sisters who are part of Metro Merfolk and the Circus Siren Pod. What brings you up here? Well, I love the Chesapeake. It's my home aside from the Atlantic. But what brought me to the beach today was I actually saw some trash floating in the bay and the ocean. And that's really not good for our environment and for our marine creatures. Everybody's going to probably want to know, because we're sitting right here on the Chesapeake Bay, have you seen Chessie and is Chessie doing well? I have seen Chessie and she is doing fabulous. She would do a bit better if the bay was even more healthy, but she's doing great. <laughs> Did you hear that, folks? We need to help Chessie. Have you seen signs where things are getting better out there? Yeah, definitely. So this is the first year in a while that it's actually been more of a healthy kind of report card. Tell me some things that, that you actually do to kind of like, you know, like get the message out uh, other than kind of coming on land and just like talking to people. Like what other things do you do to kind of like help spread the message of just trying to keep the oceans and the bay like clean? Well, the first week of June, I actually attended Capitol Hill Ocean Week in Washington, D.C. to learn more about the oceans and um, our coastal waterways and what exactly is being done to help improve the health of those. I also do a bunch of events and birthday parties. This month I am giving away a silent auction bag at the uh, Krusty Krab Jam cleanup, Ken Island cleanups doing at Red Eyes Dock Bar. And then in July I'll be at Paddle Palooza, which is put on by the Chesapeake Bay Environmental Center. Me and some of my sisters from the Circus Siren Pod will actually have our dunk take there. You can dunk a mermaid. When you do like birthday parties and whatnot, I mean, do you get like a lot of like little girls and boys who just who are just like, you know, like, I want to be a mermaid. Like, you know, I mean, like, what do you tell them? Yeah, definitely a lot of kids want to be a mermaid. Um, I was born this way, so I don't really have a, a set answer for them. But if they want to be like a mermaid, they can always eat healthy, mind the environment, and just be as active and get out on the water, protect the water, swim, be the best swimmer you can be. Now I've got some speed round questions for you. Ooh, All right, fun. are you ready? What do mermaids eat? What do you eat? I eat all kinds of seafood. I eat mussels. I love mussels. I eat uh, blue crabs. I eat shrimp. I eat everything. Have you ever tried like landlubber meat? No. No beef? I've never tried, but sometimes at festivals people will bring me pizza and I really love pizza. <laughs> now, what kind of pizza? I've only had cheese. How fast can you swim? Well, I've never raced myself, but I am the fastest in my pod. Um, I am after a marlin mermaid. Mm -hmm. I'm a marlin mermaid, like modeled like the blue marlin fish, mm -hmm. and they can swim up to six to eight miles per hour. Ooh, that's pretty good. Now, could you beat a boat? I could definitely beat a kayak. Uh, that's good, that's good. Now, have you ever kissed a prince? I have not. If there's any princes out there, I'm over here. <laughs> She's right here. What is the coolest thing you've seen underwater? Whale sharks. Whale sharks? Whale sharks. Yes. Whale sharks. It's a shark, not a whale, but they're like really big and they have spots on them that are like our fingerprints so you can tell each one by the spots on it. They're unique per each whale shark. Do we have whale sharks out there? Um, not here, but I like to travel okay. a lot. Marlins are migratory species mm -hmm. um, and like them I travel a lot. So I've actually seen whale sharks in Coral Bay, Australia. But in October, I'm actually going to La Paz, Mexico to swim with them again. How can people get a hold of you? How can people pretty much, you know, get to meet you mm -hmm. and like, you know, get to like hear your message? Tell me about that. Um, well, I live in the ocean, but I am on social media. So you can find me on Facebook and Instagram. Both of them are at Mermaid Tasha. So if you just Google Mermaid Tasha, my Facebook and my Instagram should come up. And then my email is themermaidtasha at gmail.com. You've made it very easy to like to, to find you like that. You know, some people would just have something just completely ludicrous, but no, that's good. Yeah. Mermaid Tasha. So that'll be right across the bottom of the screen. So, well, thank you, Mermaid Tasha. I guess you need to be returning to the water now. I do. I can't dry out. It's not good for me. <laughs> yeah, you'll start looking like this. So I better get her back in the water. Thanks. Thank you.